deep breaths. Hello everyone out there in YouTube land. I'm the Sen Maven. Welcome back to my channel, Shopping in Sense. So today I'm going to be showing you what I found at TJ Maxx. And this is going to be a much shorter video than what I found at Marshall's, which were super long videos. So this is a shop with me at TJ Maxx. And then I'm going to show you my very small haul from TJ Maxx. So stay tuned. So here we are at TJ Maxx looking for the good deals. And first up, we have this Morphe Glamour Bronze Face and Body Bronzer in the shade Trail Blazer. And this was $7.99. This is the inside. And there's your shade. Next up, we have this Becca Shimmer Skin Perfector from the Jaclyn Hill Collection for $5.99. And your shade is Champagne Pop. Next, we have this Doja Cat Blush Palette in Rose for $4 on clearance. And there are your shades. Then we have this Cactus Flower Dry Shampoo by Pearlescence for $3 on clearance. These really interesting hand creams in these tins by Vintage & Co. So this is $4.99 and it's in the scent Braids and Blooms. Then we have this really cute retro Christmassy one by Vintage & Co for $4.99 and it's a hand cream. And the scent is Baubles and Bells. Next we have this Honest Face and Body Lotion Truly Calming for $6.99. This Hibiscus Body Wash from Nivea for $4.99. This Goodbye Stress Body Wash from Nivea for $4.99. Then we have this Jergens Ultra Healing Body Balm for $3.99. This Aloe 92 Shower Gel in this really weird bottle for $5.99. Then we have the Dickinson's Original Witch Hazel Pore Perfecting Toner and Hydrating Toner. These, one is alcohol free, the other one doesn't say, for $3.49 each. Then we have this refillable hand sanitizer that was just weird for $3.99. Now, we found the Welly bandages before, but this is a Welly first aid kit. You get a lot of stuff in there for $16.99, all kinds of bandages, wipes, antibiotic packets. And we have this Bobbi Brown Illuminating Bronzer in the shade Maui for $16.99. Then from Spa Life, we have Vitamin C Serum, 24 Karat Gold, Pure Silver, and Hyaluronic Pearl Serum really interesting, for $6.99 each. Then we have this e.l.f. Jelly Pop collection, and it says Beauty That Pops, and this was $7.99. Next we have, from Soap & Glory, the Speed Plump All Day Super Moisturizer for $6.99. Then we have the Ellen Tracy 24 Karat Gold Facial Cream, formulated with 24 Karat Gold for Nourished and Radiant Skin. There's the top of the box. And it was going for $5.99. I don't like the Ellen Tracy Company. Then we have this Leopardina palette that's been around for like a month from Rude. Um, no price on it. The Unicarton was gone, but 12 eyeshadows. There's your shades. Then from Bite Beauty, we had this pressed powder in light um, for $7.99, light two. And that's what it looks like. Then we have the Zoeva brand again in Cocoa Blend, a highlighter palette for $3.99. And there are your shades. The Desert, and I don't know what the other one says. Then we have this Jojo Caboodle, if you're interested, for $7.99. And it has stickers and glow-in-the-dark bracelets inside. Hot Mess Express makeup section. This Orcolon Pure Amazonian Clay Palette 20 Color Shadow for $5.99. There are your shades. Then we have this Revolution Palette in Flamboyance for $5.99. This Hip Dot Collab Diamond Diva with Meatball 
$9.99. Just a rainbow palette, pretty boring. Then we have this pretty vulgar lock it in setting spray. The box was pretty banged up. $9.99, 43 set in stone. That's what it actually does. And there's the bottle. Then we have this new Hollister California California Wave perfume for $12.99. Haven't seen this one before. Then we have Menagesty from Nicki Minaj for $14.99. Casual fine perfume spray. Don't know what this is. $12.99 looked interesting. There's your bottle. I don't know. It just looked interesting. $12.99 perfume. Then we have this watermelon lemonade from Sensational. It's a woodwick candle for $7.99. Did not smell as strong as the Bath and Body Works version. Then we have this Gonzo disinfectant deodorizes and cleans for $1.99. This Bissell Pet Pro stain and odor cleaner. This was $5.99. And then we have the pink stuff. Multi-purpose cleaner, bathroom foam cleaner, and window and glass cleaner. They had this whole set. And these were $5.99 each. Then we have these chocolate poker chips, if you're hungry, while you're waiting online, for $9.99. A whole bunch. Okay, guys, I hope you enjoyed that little tour through TJ Maxx and all the interesting finds that I saw there today. So I only picked up a couple of items, which I'm going to show you now. The first thing that I picked up is I had to get a reusable bag. So I got this super cute country strawberry gingham bag and the sides are green and red. So it has like this watermelon summer picnic feel to it for 99 cents, right? Yeah, 90, 99 cents. Then of course, did I have to pick this up? No, I didn't. They had this two pack of mini bags and this is, it has denim. It has like jeans. So the thing that I like about these like mini bags and stuff that I pick up is that you can use them as gift bags. Now, you know, when you give a birthday gift and stuff, this might even be good for a man. This is like a unisex type thing. So I don't like really giving gift bags, birthday bags because people toss them or they reuse them but not for like this purpose. This was $1.49 and I really think you could just use this as a gift bag and then it just becomes part of the gift and it's really uh, sturdy for to hold things in. So uh, $1.49 for these two reusable bags. Then I wanted to pick this up the last time when I was in Marshalls and I was so hoping to find it again. They had a few of these. I really need this. This is the Miracle of Aloe miracle heel stick and cracked heels due to dry skin with ultra aloe so yeah i just had a pedicure done and i get one done every two weeks and for some reason i just keep getting dry heels and i get this treatment where the the nail tech she puts this cream on my heels and then you know she scrapes it with that thing that looks like a cheese grater and i'm like how do i keep accumulating dry skin on my heels and she's like well you have to put vaseline on your heels after you get out of the shower and leave it on for 10 minutes and i'm like mm, i ain't doing that i'm gonna walk around with vaseline sit there with vaseline she's like yeah just watch tv and have the vaseline on your heels knowing me i would get up and i'd go whoop, and go sliding across my floor so i'm gonna try this um Miracle Heel Stick, and I will let you know how it is. And this was uh, $5.99. Then I know I just picked up some uh, setting powder recently, and I almost got that Bite powder in light, but then I found this one that was cheaper. So I was like, okay, I'm going to try this one. This is the e.l.f. brand, and this is Sheer Tint Finishing Powder. And I'm telling you guys, for the longest time, I didn't know that e.l.f. meant eyes, lips, face. I was like under a rock. So this is the Sheer Tint Finishing Powder in Fair Light. And this was only $2.99. So that is a deal. Now, I just I opened this to make sure nobody used it. It was already open. Okay, so I'm gonna show you what this looks like. This doesn't come with a puff. The other one came with a puff. Oh, it does come with a puff. Okay, so here it is. 
And then this is what it looks like. It's around my, I think it's around my skin tone. And then the bottom part opens up, which I thought it did. Now I can't open it. Oh, yeah. So then you have your little puff. Well, sponge anyway. So it has the sponge in the bottom. And then you have your powder. So, yes, yeah, so I got the e.l.f. setting powder. And the last thing that I picked up, I told you guys it wasn't going to be a big haul. Um, I think you guys know what I picked up. You're going to be like, no, you didn't pick that up. And I'm like, yes, I did. <laughs> so you guys know I hauled the Pink Friday perfume last time by Nicki Minaj. And I have it in the fine fragrance mist so i had to pick up what i saw today i had to get menagesty another Nicki minaj perfume so i don't think i have i'm almost certain i don't have this in the spray in the fine fragrance mist i keep seeing the uh onika one in the spray and i'm tempted to get it but i feel like the ariana grande ones like they all smell the same so this one is menagesty and I don't know what the bottle looks like on this. I don't remember. I hope it's not like going to be like Pink Friday where it's shaped like a her head and it's so hard to open. Like you have to, yeah, it's going to be, it's going to be like that. Oh boy. This one's even worse. This one's even more tacky. Oh my Lord. It's like scary. <laughs> it's like scary mannequin scary. Jesus. Nikki, what is with this? Okay, so this is Menage T. Okay, so her head pops right off. The other one was weird because her head was here and then her hair was like long. So this is Menage T. And obviously it wasn't open. So we'll spray. This one, I like it. I have to say... I do smell a difference between this and Pink Friday. This one has more of like a fruity scent to it. It's nice. I like it. I'm going to say for right now, I like Pink Friday better. But this is definitely a nice change, like to change it up. Yeah, it has this... It has this fruity, like citrusy undertone to it that Pink Friday doesn't have. So, yeah, I like it, but I definitely like Pink Friday better. So, there's Menagesty. And I'm not putting it back in the box. I'm just going to put the boxes out on display and then leave the bottles out. Because, you know, like sometimes I will like a perfume in the beginning and then I'll switch off and then it'll be like the only perfume that I wear and then I switch back. So it's nice. It's nice. I wore pink Friday today and I do definitely like the box packaging and stuff. So yeah, so that's that. And that is my haul from TJ Maxx. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Remember to comment, rate, subscribe, follow me on Instagram at shopping and sense. I will see you all in a future video, but until then, goodbye everyone out there in YouTube land.